show you this one. This is my anniversary one. And this here, what I did is, I forgot that I had these. I cut this in half, this, um, this um, <clears throat> head wrap. I cut it, and I had these magnets that I had years and years. I forgot, I, 50 cents. I got these for 50 cents at, um, I don't know if they were at Joann's or something. I don't know. But anyway, I had a few of these. And what I did is I put the magnet on it. So there it is. So that's another closure for my book. But this is my anniversary. Look at how beautiful this. Here's my anniversary cover. Doesn't matter what year it was. This was 2008. And like I say, I'm going to be married 45 years. But here are some beautiful, beautiful cards from my wife, for my from my husband, for his, for his wife, from our children. Look at the beautiful cards. Now, like I say, you go here and you just look them over like this, like a book. No matter how you look at it. You two are perfect for each other. And this is from my daughter and her son. And what I did is because I didn't I didn't have enough room to punch the holes, all I did was just put it on a piece of cardstock, poke the holes in the cinch. So easy. I couldn't believe by using the cinch, see how this is a little bit different? It's not even with the other card. All I did is I knew that I had so many uh, rings, and uh, that's what I did with this, with the birthday one. I, I mean, I really like the cinch. I think I'm gonna naturally going to use this more and more. But instead of wasting all of these uh, uh, rings, I went ahead and instead of using maybe eight, eight rings, um, I went ahead and only used six. So here is the anniversary one again. We pay. I was telling my husband I showed that. We pay for stamps like that. That's a real, that's a real stain. But we pay for stamps like that to look like watermark stains and coffee stains and stuff. So there's that one. And this one has the little copper, which turned out great. I think I'll put like maybe a little embellishment there. I don't know. But there is my anniversary one. And one last one. Did I show you this one? Oh, and this is my Mother's Day. Look at this. How beautiful. This one was my first one I made. I think it turned out pretty good. Here's the beautiful card that I wanted um, on the front. So this is my Mother's Day. It shows right there. Here's my Mother's Day tag that I used. And it's nothing fancy because, like I say, this is just for me to kind of go through and read it as a book. And look at how beautiful. One, two, three. Go through here. Go through here. Here is one. Naturally, like I say, my son didn't date this, but I know this is old. This is for my son. Let's see if we can get some funny stuff. This is, I know that this is a, uh, an older one only because it was signed by my son and my daughter. So this is when they were younger. This stuff. Like here, this is from my, from my daughter. Oh, come on. I wasn't that bad. Happy Mother's Day. Here's a silly one. Look, Mom. Lily ate the fridge magnets again, and she stuck to the magnet. Thanks for sticking with me through thick and thin. Happy Mother's Day. This is for my daughter. See, look, see, these are just so precious. Oh, there's another one. And let's see, this was 2006 for my wife. <laughs> look, and it still works. 2006. It's 2014. And then here's another beautiful one, and this is a pretty heavy cardstock, so I use that card as the back of the book. That's the front of the book. Great binder. Put that in there. I could go on and on and on and babble, babble, babble. I mean, I just had so much fun doing this and looking through all of this again. I mean, I just, like I say, I just had so much fun doing this. I got sentimental. It brought back a lot of memories when I was young and I was newly married with my husband and then having the children and uh, parts of it where my, you know, my husband was drafted into the service and in Vietnam and 
Oh, like I say, I could go on and on. But that's what it's all about, though, isn't it? It's all about memories. And these are my memories. These are that, you know, that maybe one day when the kids come over and I can go ahead and have them laugh and show my grandson, show our grandsons about the beautiful cards that were given, given to me. Um, that how much I treasure and how much um, they mean to me. And um, sometimes you can't put it in words. So, anyway, I just wanted to share this with you. Oh, and what I'm going to do is, um, I, too, uh, have some stuff. Like I say, we're going to be married 45 years in November, and going through all of this, I have my, I went through all my pictures, and that's another, like I say, that's another project. But I did find my uh, wedding cake topper, and I had this doll, and I don't remember. It was so long ago. I don't remember what this doll was for. I don't know. But anyway, I found the doll, and I'm going to bling it up a little bit. Uh, I'm going to embellish it a little bit more, and I will show uh, the before and the after, but just kind of let, let you show you what I did is I had to steam it to get all the wrinkles out, but it's all sat satin. I don't know how well you can see this. And it looks like whoever made this, my mom is starting to get uh, dementia, so um, I, I don't know if I ask her, if I show her the doll, I don't know if she'll remember who did this, but it looks like there's, it's a handkerchief. And they hand-stitched the lace on the handkerchief. And look at how old this doll is. This is pretty old. Well, it's at least 45 years old. Let's see if you can see. And it, you know, if you do, her eyes do close if you, you know, kind of force it. Let's see. Whoops. There you go. Anyway, um, here is, uh, I kind of had to do a fabric tack and, and kind of sew her um, dress back. And um, I don't really remember. Let's see if you can see it a little bit better. See how she's got her. And then you go like this and push the lace up. And there she is. And there's the ring. A little bit of embellishment. So I am, um, I will show you what, how I went ahead and um, redid this a little bit. Kind of. But anyway, I just wanted to show you that. So this is what I wanted to show you. So thank you very much for watching. Bye.